Behind the scenes, behind the lines, inside the stories others won't tell. The Morning Insiders. The Morning Insiders want you to take a very close look at this number. Viewer Mike Smith in Warrenville wrote us saying, let's hold the people accountable for passing a bill that increases fees 555%. CBS 2's Tim McNicholas introduces us to the man fighting to toe the line on a skyrocketing trailer registration fee. I only pull it out twice a year. Mike Smith takes his boat down to Shelbyville every summer. He questions the new licensing fees for the trailer that hauls it. I'm down there for three, four days, eight days a year, and it's going to cost me $20 a day just for the license plates? I don't burn that much in fuel a day when I'm down there fishing. These fee hikes are part of a new infrastructure bill the General Assembly voted on. I'm not arguing that you don't need money for infrastructure. Most people aren't. Smith says the fee hikes aren't fair. Lawmakers raised all sizes of trailers by 100 bucks. Simple, right? Well, not really. You can see a trailer in the TN class is huge. The increase from this V to this, that's about a 7% jump. So how does this work out for Mike's trailer? Well, he used to pay $18, now 118. That's a whopping 555% increase. That's insane. It makes no sense whatsoever. Yeah. Smith's brother, Tim, has the same complaint. He owns both of these trailers. The recreational trailer will cost him $30 this year, same as last year. I'm happy to see that one. <laughs> but he will pay the new $118 fee for the tiny trailer in front of it. Renewal fees in four years will cost as much as the darn trailer costs. It, it just, it's absurd. It's craziness. Smith says this bill needs a rewrite. They didn't do their homework. They didn't pay attention to what they passed. We're trying to bring it to their attention so that they can go back, correct it, and do the right thing. Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News. So Mike Smith, he might be onto something. Republican House Bill 3851 would reverse the vehicle tax for small trailers like his. State Representative Grant Worley from Naperville just added as he was just added as a sponsor and tells us the quote rush process in Springfield is what leads to unintended consequences like the monster increase in small trailer fees.